Morning team, it is Sunday. We are in a random hotel room for a ridiculous reason. I spent $100 on a hotel last night when I didn't have to. I could have stayed at Chris's because we've been sick for like 12 or 13 or 14 days. And my theory on being sick is if it doesn't go away after a couple days, you have to like get a really good night's sleep. Well, there was the launch, so I didn't get good sleep around there. There was Miami, the shitty Airbnb with, with the awful bed and the the break-in next door. I didn't get good sleep there. And then Chris's is amazing, but he lives above a fire station in Harlem. So like, like literally through the night every night. So I didn't get sleep there. And I was like, I need a good night's sleep or I'm not gonna be healthy. And so I booked a hotel in New Jersey and that's where we are. We're gonna do some work at this desk with a little monster or coffee or maybe even nothing. I feel pretty good. And, uh, and yeah, we're gonna get it today. Also, feel great. Like, it worked. I would have felt like an idiot if it didn't work, but I feel it worked. I feel great. All right, we just did a bunch of work here. Pretty productive morning. About to get back into the city get some food in me. All I've had is a cup and a half of coffee and probably 40 ounces of water. And, uh, and then I need to join a gym that's like flexible and short term because I don't really know where I'm going to be living, but I need somewhere, um, and get a workout today. So that's my plan. All right. So this isn't the most macro friendly, but it's really delicious. We got a bagel with ketchup, extra egg and cheese. Um, Probably like 25 protein, 22 fat, 50 carb, but nice little pre-workout meal. All right, going to work out. My man Joey has uh, a membership at Blink where he has unlimited guest passes, so I'm just going to go with him. Um, yeah, I actually don't know what I'm training. I'm very, like, these last two weeks I've been in a, a real flux with, uh, with a poor half-ass go into the gym and like decide what I feel like doing that day. Um, so in the next week I should definitely get myself on some kind of regimented program. So. We're about to, we're hitting arms? We're hitting something, yeah. I don't have legs right now, so. So hang on, can you tell them that I wanted to hit legs, yeah. but you can't hit legs? Legs and, what do you say, legs and arms or legs and biceps? Legs and biceps. And I have a bum knee right now and I was like, <laughs> no legs for me. <laughs> I wanted to train the lower body, I did. I mean, Joey just, I'm not sure I believe it because you do know I had a bum knee, so it's just like, yeah, 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 let's do, let's do some legs. <laughs> Did that cross your mind? <laughs> just further explain what's going on with this, like, lack of a training program. What I've been doing on this travel, not taking things super seriously, being busy with work, is um, training every other day and having one day be all upper and the other day be lower plus arms. So this is like a lower plus arm maintenance bullshit workout that you're about to see. All right, welcome to the video. Um, what's up? How is everyone? Here I am doing some reverse lunges. Uh, I, I'm not going to do like a walkthrough. I'll talk a little bit about the workout, but really I want to talk about the vlog and I want to talk about training footage in the vlog because... Um, we can do whatever we want with it, and what I want to do with it is what you guys want. Uh, training footage can, can do a number of things that I have seen. Me training, I can do a voiceover where I explain what I'm doing, where I talk about my split, like obviously when I'm doing something more serious or that I care more about. Um, here we're just doing a little close grip bench, hitting the triceps, did a few sets here, and then just did 135 for like four sets of 10 to 12. Um, but these videos can be instructional. And what I actually like more than me training for the purpose of instructional videos is me training a client. So like, you know, finding someone, it could even be like a random giveaway to someone in the New York area and film it and train them and like talk in the video, of, like make that the instructional video. Um, the other thing you can do with workout footage, there's Joey, by the way, who's jacked. Uh, the other thing we can do with video, with workout video, excuse me, is an edit or like what's basically 
what's basically softcore porn, like realistically. An edit is uh, like crazy camera work definition, um, great lighting, pump, uh, slow shots, music. It, it's really like it's a, it's a level above softcore porn, which there's value in that, in like the entertainment and building an audience. But as you guys know, if you follow me anywhere other than YouTube, like Instagram, it's just not really my game. Um, and, and I don't want it to be my game. So I'm like, maybe we'll do a little bit of cool effects, but there isn't going to be like ab zoom ins and, and things like that. Like that's just, it's just not something I want to get into. Uh, but I do plan on, even though I don't love like I like getting in the zone when I train and that requires focus. That actually usually means not working with a partner. Uh, but there'll, I'll definitely be recording more of my training sessions as we move forward. And once I find someone for that video position, um, I think I only did six exercises today, reverse lunges and goblet squats, uh, to get a little lower body volume in. And then, there's the hammer and the, the strict underhand curls and then that overhand cable and some uh, a little bit of close grip bench press. But yeah, this this is going to be running out pretty soon, I think. Let me know in the comments what you want to see, though. I'm, I'm down to film some workouts. I'm down to film some giveaways, some training sessions, which I think would be cool. Um, but yeah, I'm excited, guys. I'm excited about these vlogs. If you haven't been noticing... Jesse and I, Jesse, who's my get shit done executive slash design slash super smart dude, um, who's helping with some of these edits actually, have been consistently uploading 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So I don't know how long that will go, but if you want to be on the lookout for videos at 9 p.m. EST, that's what we've been doing. Um, yeah, thank you for watching. <laughs> What's up? I'm back at Chris's in Harlem. You can see the Hudson River out there. Um, I'm, uh, I'm about to have a, a phone conversation that I'll film some of. It'll be long, but I'll include whatever is valuable for you guys, which I think a lot of you will benefit from. Uh, it's a, a talk with a guy who's training clients in the gym and is pretty full with training clients in the gym right now, and just kind of a life strategy discussion. Um, and then, I'm gonna go downstairs and get uh, a salad, some protein, some micros, and some carbs, probably banana, cliff bar. Um, we'll see what else is down there for dinner. Uh, and just do some computer work tonight. It's like five o'clock, um, so I have, have some time. Probably spend a solid hour tonight too planning out my week. Just, just wanna be dialed. So that's what's going on. Here's the call. It's not to say you can't accomplish what you want to accomplish there, but it is to yeah. say that it's easier if you have a, a group that's more like-minded and, and pushing each other. Yeah, like I think, I think like getting the YouTube stuff going and you know possibly writing. I don't uh, it, to it to, me, to I quote don't. to quote Arnold Schwarzenegger. Like, you don't think you don't like possibly you don't maybe get something started yeah. like do, like do it. Don't possibly start writing like write. A an article a week and don't possibly get the YouTube thing going tell your boy who's helping you like yo we need to pump out three videos a week and like we're gonna yep. do it starting Monday yeah all right man thanks for the time you bet but but for real get started like I don't want to in three weeks see that you haven't like yeah. been jamming content yeah yep you're right all right bro email me if you need anything <laughs> yeah thanks all right later Sam all right bye all right, guys, we're at the store. We got dinner right here. So we got this grilled chicken, uh, spinach, arugula, carrot, cucumber, honey mustard, double chicken, and then uh, juice with a bunch of fruits and vegetables, like like eight servings in there for only $5, which is insane. And this guy. And this meal, in large part, summarizes how I feel about food and nutrition and fitness in general. Like, do pretty good, like the smart stuff, fruits, vegetables, lean proteins, most of the time, and then some of the time, have a that's probably unhealthy that you really enjoy. Calories, macronutrients, where they should be, pretty close at least most of the time. A um, few questions recently. Some, like on a recent video, someone asked a question about some type of water that I had never even heard of. Uh, and, and my girl, Leora, who I love, and she knows I love her very much, but she's like, <laughs> she's like, 
I, I challenge you, there are, are benefits to intermittent fasting beyond just meal timing and making adherence easier. And yes, like I could sit here and I could talk about um, insulin sensitivity and I could talk about uh, for an intermediate to advanced lifter who wanted to recomp, like didn't want to gain too much body fat, but like just wanted to build muscle and lose fat, maybe like one pound of each over a very long period of time. 16-8, stacking a, a fasted training session right before you break your fasting window. Yes, that's effective, but like for 99.9% .9 of people, stuff doesn't matter, which is why I don't care about being optimal, which is why I'm never gonna like not have the Pop-Tarts with this meal when I want the Pop-Tarts, because it's not about being optimal. It's about being pretty good most of the time, consistently, and in time you're gonna win. No hate to Lior either. Um, all right, I gotta get home, I don't know where I am. Uh, let's actually wrap this vlog up here. I'll see you tomorrow.